Peyton Man is recovering from a gunshot wound after two juveniles try to break in his house. Yeah, the juveniles are in custody and police need help with a case they believe is related. Two News reporter Judith Rutana has new information on what police are asking from the public. The two minors arrested are awaiting formal charges tonight. Dayton police say they're linked to another crime in the area. Now they need your help finding a stolen vehicle. Just before midnight on Tuesday, Dayton police say a man was shot in the foot as two people tried to break into his house. To be this close, it's, it's, a, it's more alarming than it is surprising. The shooting happened on Dwight Avenue. This neighbor says he just moved to the area last fall. I was kind of hoping that the neighborhood I chose was a little safer. Uh, but, you know, it can happen anywhere. Nearly three hours after the shooting, police say the suspect struck again about a mile away. Police say the suspect robbed a pizza delivery driver. They took his phone, car, and pizzas. Due to some fantastic uh, legwork by detectives and officers, a link was uh, established, and uh, two juvenile suspects were taken into custody. Police now need your help locating the pizza driver's car. It's a 2016 black Mazda 3 Sport with Tennessee plate 5K68Z3. Crime can ab absolutely happen anywhere. Uh, no, no neighborhood is immune uh, from crime taking place. Lieutenant Hall says there are steps you can take to determine deter criminals from your home. The exterior lighting on the home, motion lighting, uh, view, view holes and doors. Neighbors I talked to say they're reassessing their home security. Yeah, definitely. You know, you just need to take a look at it. Now, if you have any information about the car's location, you are asked to call police or Miami Valley Crime Stoppers. This case will be taken to the Montgomery County Prosecutor to determine what charges can be filed. Judith Hartana, 2 News, working for you.